Nah, not even kidding. You better pick that up. I don't care. No, I don't. Who the f do you think you are shitting on my property? Oh my god. <laughs> I did not expect this. I, listen, <laughs> when I came in here to film this video, <laughs> this is the last thing I expected to see. I'm not going to lie. Clean it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. <laughs> Pick it up. Pick it up. You better pick it up. Man, <laughs> you can't poop on other people's <laughs> property. What the heck? Oh my gosh. I mean, listen, sometimes nature calls and you got to do your business, but you have to pick it up after. <laughs> gosh. Excuse me, sir. This lady's harassing me. I asked you, you know nicely. Many, you have insecurities You're that are like... You're you're very incapacitated right now, and you're bothering. No, you're bothering me, and you should leave my area. I asked you so no. many times. Listen, I get being you know intoxicated, having some drinks, and that sort of thing. But like, I just don't understand how people get like beyond themselves, like where you can't even like hear what's going on around you or like have a conversation or anything like that. You know what I mean? Even your friend hey. is not trying to get you out of here. So hey. why don't you just listen to your you're friend? Okay, you had too much to drink. Okay, and it's very, very obvious. So leave me alone. Hey. And even she will agree. Just leave me alone. I mean, he made it very clear. He was like, honestly, not even being mean. And he said, leave me alone. You're bothering me like at least three or four times. So I'm just confused why she's so confused. Ugh, man, life, not the mm. pool. old ladies just need to be the problem. <laughs> like, there's absolutely no reason for her to interact with these people who are just in the pool enjoying themselves at all. And she was like, nope, I'm gonna swim directly through here and cause an issue. Also, I love that, first of all, they didn't really stop playing. They were like, okay, lady, just let us get back to our game. And also, when they all started waving bye, I love it. That probably rattled her more than anything else, which personally, I love. Oh my God, the wipers are still going. Oh, she's in a swimsuit. Does she have a sunburn? <laughs> Um, yeah, I mean, this video is Karen's who ruined their own vacation, but I mean, <laughs> the vacation might have been ruined, but she didn't let anything stop her. Tis but a scratch. <laughs> She's not letting anything stop her, eh? Oh my gosh, imagine the audacity, the bravery. What did you expect? I mean, <laughs> geez Louise, I appreciate the vibes. <laughs> That's really all I can say. He's not in the Sit down. Okay, okay I'll listen. Sit down. Please get out of my face. Sit. You just hit my f Sit the f get down. out of my face. Sit down. Sit down. The officer's supposed to be there. Sit down. I'm not working right now. I'm on vacation. I will f you up. Sit down. Sit down. Do what he says. Sit down. You don't Okay, so it seems like the guy who's saying sit down is like an off-duty cop or something like that. And then obviously, like he said, the other guy hit his car. I just feel like if you're off-duty, like there's clearly a police officer there, so you should probably just let the person who's in uniform deal with everything. Cause like, you know, how do you know, first of all? I'm recording no, the whole thing. So. I will. See who that believe. 
Hey, will you get out of my vehicle, please? Hey, sit down. Sit down. But then when she said sit down, then the guy sat down. You know, like you just, she's on the clock, <laughs> if you will. So I get why um, he was angry and I get why he was just, you know, used to commanding the situation, but it probably would just be best for everyone involved if the um, uniformed police officer did the thing. Also shout out to the person who gave me the word antagonist. <laughs> if you know, you know. <laughs> There's nowhere else to put you. You're lucky you got in a room. You're lucky you got in a room for what we got you. We put you in a closet. Last night. Well, first of all, Miss Rose. I do not want to talk to you. I do not, not want to talk to you. you. Wow. I don't know why you feel that <laughs> oh, way God, about shut me. Shut up. I don't know Ebony, 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 just stop. Yes, So please. I don't want to talk to you. I'm not going to argue with a fool. I'm just not. So we're both asking questions. I know you ask questions. Are we going to have a conversation? This is just the same hotel that as before. I don't know about that. I, see, the problem is they didn't give me much context in that one, you know? Like, sometimes I get like I get like an argument, and someone says this. There's usually a little bit more context. This one's kind of hard to react to, because there's, there's, there's a lot of hand movements, a lot of this, a lot of this, a lot of y'all are fools. Y'all are just fools. But other than that, I didn't get much. So besides y'all are fools, I didn't get anything to go off. Don't touch me. Don't, 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 don't touch me. Okay, ladies. What did you say? What did you say? What did you say? I heard what you said. <laughs> like, what on earth? Like, I don't even know why she's freaking out, but what do you expect to happen? I, I say that all the time, but it's real. What do you expect to happen when you just scream and you know, <laughs> like nothing. They're still gonna kick you out of the restaurant. Bye bye. No bread for you. I don't know. <laughs> I was like, what's something that all restaurants have? Bread. Unless you're a gluten free place. Well, maybe a gluten free bread. <laughs> I was holding a parking spot for my friend who was coming right in traffic, and these don't people do that. tried to literally run me over. Because you're standing in a parking spot. So I am waiting for them to get out of their car. So they chat with them and they won't get out of their car. Yeah, because you're being weird. Back up. Back up. Back up. I'm not moving. I'm not moving. I'm not moving. Get the f out. Are you out of your mind? Are you out of your mind? There's 0% running over happening. Um, that's clearly someone who's just like, no. <laughs> just, and are you out of your mind? You're standing there thinking that you're gonna win versus a car. It doesn't work like that. Also, you can't save a public parking space for your friend who, first of all, you said was coming in traffic. And then in your second clip, you said was circling the block. Two different things, okay? I don't think, also, why are they circling the block? What's that about? If you got a parking space lined up for them, what's the point of them circling the block? I'm just asking for you to be respectful. Yes, and frankly, we, that is not. We definitely understand. And, and you weren't great either yelling back at me. If I came and sat up in your backyard and just wanted to talk to you, you I wouldn't speak to you like that. Okay. Okay, I'm, I'm okay it would be with over this. in two seconds if you just shut up. I know, honestly, and she's wrong. I live here, I know. So please relax. Have a good time. I'm sure you're gonna do that. Finny, but if you don't understand why I'm annoyed in my backyard, and I yes. Yes. Finny, come on. Well, one more, one more time, and I will get someone down here to explain what the colony owns. Go ahead. We own right Go now. Go ahead. Get the police. I told what you all that. Really what is the matter with you? We're doing so bad with the police. What's wrong with this for? We just told you. We own it. Would we come on to our front yard? We actually own it. We got under the water. That's what we got. On. Wait, okay, so. <laughs> Does this lady own the beach? I have a strange feeling she does not, but hey, I don't know. Show me the title. You know what I'm saying? Show me where it says that you own the beach, and then I'm on her side. If she owns the beach, I'm on her side. Yes, faulty, faulty. Back up. 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 Back up.
It's like, imagine, you know, having the privilege to shop at a high end store like Dior is, and then still being that entitled. Okay, so she wants to say you don't own the shop. Okay, do you? I'm like, seems we're at a standstill then. <laughs> like, just follow the rules. Then you can spend your money. You can get a tiny little bag if you want. You know, the world is your oyster. But you can't just freak out. That's really a bad solution. <laughs> the DJ is my hero. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I would give anything to know like what it, is she upset because it's loud? I bet that's what she's upset about, but I could just vaguely hear her screaming at the end. But other than that, it was just straight vibes from the DJ who called security, but it really like blended in well with the set, which I respect and appreciate. Go to a club, go to a club, you're right, you're gonna get Shut up, I called the cop. Go to bed. You called the cop at the hotel, bro, where are you? All right, let's get to the way we're done. What do you mean it's all right? We are. Take a chill. We got you. We're running up and down the halls. You're an adult. What is that guy wearing? Are you kidding? You're the one wearing a mask. What? The dude's in a suit or something. I think this is going to be like a first time only, but I think I kind of slightly, I don't fully agree with the Karen, but I think I, I kind of, I, I think I can see where she's coming from. I don't think she said anything heinous there. So that, that's good. As long as she didn't say anything heinous, that's fine. Uh, should she, is she perhaps overreacting? Yes. But should these young uh, gentlemen be uh, being rowdy in the hotel lobby? Not the hotel lobby, the hotel hallways. I'm going to say no. I'm going to say no on that one. And dude's wearing a, a superhero suit for, for some reason. Uh, it's, it, you know, it's, it is a hotel. I'm going to, I'm going to give her the benefit of the doubt and hope it's 2 a.m. And you know, she's trying to sleep. Maybe she's got an important business meeting. I don't know. But uh, I, I kind of see where she's coming from uh, on that one. But at the same time, maybe you just take a little too far on that one. Just a little bit. He's calling the cops on me. Calling the cops? I'm taking a phone call at the okay. Tree Hotel. Say hi, Earl. Hi, Earl. Say hello. <laughs> you came over here because I was taking a phone call in the area where no one was. I had a family emergency and I was taking family a phone emergencies call are important. This guy's harassing me. Okay. I don't know about that. <laughs> And the, this looks like he's in the hotel lobby. And and Earl, I like, I like, he's like, say hi, Earl. And he's just like, hey, I gotta kick him out of the hotel. I don't know why people can't just leave people alone. What, what's the guy doing? He's chilling. It looks like his feet were up on the couch or the chair or something. So I don't know, maybe don't don't put your feet up on the on the furniture. But other than that, like, dude's chilling. Let him let him have his family emergency. Let him have his uh, Dr. Phil moment. Let him just deal with what he's got to deal with. If that's the case. Again, I don't know. We I never see all the whole videos. I don't know the full context. I'm just here to react to what I get shown. So that's that's all I can do is my best. Dang, so I guess this guy's a lifeguard and like somebody had told them not to go out into the water and then they were doing it anyway. And then he came over to be like, what the f man?
listen, I don't know nothing about surfing or really any water activities other than floating. Um, but I feel like the lifeguard is being really reasonable and I appreciate that he's passionate about people's safety. That's kind of what you want in a lifeguard. So I respect that, you know? He was assertive, but he was worried about them and he's doing his job, I think. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong, because again, like I mentioned, I know zero about surfing. I came down and asked for bedding. You're telling me I wait till tomorrow for pillows. And I the hide a bed. You, there are no pillows here. There are six pillows in the room. Why do you need more than six pillows? Look, <coughs> take two of them off and put them on but the hide a bed. Couch. Sleeping on those beds, using them. Put them. There's how many more people in there? Uh, don't worry. How many it's people all accounted are in for. the room? Well, maybe you should look at the computer it's and see. It's only registered for how many? Okay, so hold on a minute. Now hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. This might be uh, this might be a reversal. This might be the Yu-Gi-Oh reversal card here. This video was meant to be on his side. It was meant to be on his side. But right at the very end there, he's like, oh, but there's people and people using it. And the guy goes, wait, how many people are in your room? Ah, uh, see, that's the thing. That's the thing. You got to look at the rules and regulations. The rules probably are one person per bed, maybe two people per bed. I don't know what he said, but it sounds like he didn't have the recommended amount. And that's, that's, you broke the rules. You broke the rule. You broke the rules. You can't do that. Yeah, so I'm kind of on the hotel side there. I don't know. Love the haircut. It's your job to check us in. You said I could not log in. Could not log in. See how it is. Okay. Mr. Parrish, help me to get your confirmation numbers and your ID. An ID, yeah. Okay. Now y'all don't want to do that. Y'all don't want to do that. You want my confirmation number? You have my ID. So is that the missing link? You need my confirmation number? Then you'll get me in a room. Hmm, something's wrong there. Something ain't adding up there. Something about a confirmation number. I mean, it's pretty simple, isn't it? You phone a couple weeks in advance. You say, hey, I'm coming in, got a room. And they go, yeah, right away, we'll get a room. And then, and then you book the room and, and that's it. So there could be, and then when she says, that was the owner of the hotel, I'm all alone here. Are you not the front desk though? There's, there's something not working there. Someone call uh, Gordon Ramsay. Someone call the guy from Bar Rescue. Figure that out. Go to that business. Check their business. I'd like to see, you know what? I'd like to see your kitchen. If you can't run your desk, I want to see what you're cooking. It's probably not good. It don't matter. Don't, matter. don't live here. Don't, don't, you don't, don't live, live here. here. I know you don't live here because you can't afford it. Oh, no, no, no. What are you talking Double about? Y. We live here. Double I own that apartment. Double Y. Three other I don't people. give a. You better respect these Who children. Who are respect the children? Right. They weren't even in the road. Like what in the world? Who just walks up to a stranger and goes, I know you don't live here cause you can't afford it. Like how would you possibly know that? There's absolutely zero way for you to know that. These Karens really just be out here assuming stuff. Also this, that's how you get your point across when you're a Karen. <laughs> This I can tell before Chris even played. This looks right now. Looking at her, I'm I'm judging a book by its cover. It looks like she's gonna call police for something that's not gonna be necessary. Why are you calling Hi. the cops right now? Hi. Because Hi. I told you I wasn't leaving the park. <laughs> did I? What did I say, Chris? Right I'm, I'm not verbally <laughs> assaulting you. I told you I'm not leaving. The Attleboro Dog Park. That's inappropriate for the dog. No, it's not. I know it's the whole company each other. She's calling the cops. Whoa, the dog's, dog's doing that. Uh, dog. Every dog's doing, what do every single dog hump another <laughs> dog here. Whoa. And she tells me to leave, and now she's calling the cops. I mean, guys, did I not re rewind the clock back 20 seconds ago when I said the thing? It looks like she's gonna call police for something that's not gonna be necessary. I uh, see. I said it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, I did. Yeah, I said it, and I was right. She, I could, I could just tell the way it's, it's, it's. She's pretend. It's, it looks calm, but she is not calm. The adrenaline is rushing through her veins, and she is, she is ready to be a just a warrior of the people. And and how dare your dog do some stuff in the dog park? And <sighs> okay. Like, why do people think they own the beach? Like, there's so much space. Oh my god! 
if you don't like what somebody's doing in one area, go, go to the pool. Like there's so many options, the park, just anywhere else, another beach. There's likely more wherever you are. Like, I just don't understand it. Also just laying down after <laughs> that was a full defeat. Yes, because you denied my children the right to walk down here. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, we got her. Don't worry. What? It's fine. No. This lady's acting like she owns the woods. <laughs> I can't. There's something about people yelling like this that is just so funny to me. It's just so extra. Like she is absolutely screaming. Absolutely screaming. <laughs> It's just so extra like they're just trying to walk down to the river like we're all outside. What do you mean? <laughs> this is so weird. It's so weird. I don't know. I don't go camping So like maybe there are like things that I'm missing, but <laughs> come on just chill lady. Holy smokes If you're so picky and so mm, 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 I don't want this and I don't want this then you shouldn't be on the subway that's for everyone you know what I mean like it's just a little bit <laughs> What in the world? Also, I can't hear you. I'm like, you clearly can't. <laughs> like, we're not four anymore. You know what I mean? When it's a busy subway, your bag does not get a seat. And if your bag does get a seat, then expect somebody to come over and sit on it. Nice floors. No swearing. You're not gonna take the out. You can go as well. You can go too. Where, well. Where's your manager? You get your own duty manager on the phone. Yeah, you do that. I'll call him too. Hmm. There's like four of you one there. I don't know. Saying she's a child. I guess. I guess the it sounds like the employee swore at the customer there, which of course is not. You shouldn't do that. <laughs> Don't do that, dude. But yeah, the the four v one or five v one that's happening right now uh, makes me kind of question what's going on. I don't know. I guess it could be here. I don't know. That's that's so tough because I've been in situations like that where it's like, yeah, there's been a couple customers that like they start they start ganging up on you. Do we not just complain I'm to you not about? Even going to discuss you? Not even going to discuss to you. Clients. What are we talking about? We just booked a room and we're telling. You that there's we're, on the we've been there's complaining since we room. got here. There's in the room, and Wait, you're not man. doing anything look, look. about it. Chill, man, chill. We've documented this already okay. with the person that was here before you. Okay. So this has been documented. And you just acknowledge that. Okay. So you, you're acknowledging you just came up to, up to our room and cleaned boogers off our wall, right? I don't know whether or not they were boogers or not. Or I don't even know if they, they were, were boogers. I'm sorry. Did that man just say there were boogers on his wall? Did he just say listen? I know some people out there, and you don't have to say it's you. It's okay. You don't have to let us know. It's fine. But I know some people out there, they make booger walls. And if you heard me say that and you go, how does he know about my booger wall? I know. Chetty knows. I know, dude. We, I know. I know what you're doing. I know, I know what you're doing. I am an empath, actually. Nah, but that's, that's pretty gross. I, there's always, there's a part of me that even as a rough lumberjack, redneck Canadian, I, I, there's still a part of me that's like, when I go into hotels, or anything and like I kind of just got to look at the bed for a minute like am I really gonna sleep in that bed tonight that 400 people have also slept in and probably done other heinous things in that bed Whew. you hear squishy noises in your head you know what I mean you're like I don't know what's and then yeah uh, no I don't know hotels man unless it's the Villaggio you know I don't know and I'm, I'm not a bougie guy but I'm just saying the Villaggio is probably cleaner than it's probably cleaner than like El Rey's motel down the road and this guy like hey welcome to El Rey's motel no vacancy come on in <laughs> Why is everyone bothering people in pools? Get out of the pool now. 
Folks, it's not a big serious deal. Let him do his thing, man. It's it's fine, okay? Well, we can let him do his thing. There you go. If Collier County comes around, we'll I know. You said that once. It sees him. I understand. It's okay. All right. Good work, though. <laughs> Oh my god. So I, I'm guessing that like the pool is closed or something and so like he's not supposed to be Swimming and these this Karen couple decided to take it into their own hands If you were the person who was operating the pool, that's definitely your business at this point the pools closed You can't be here. We all agree on that But if you're just a random Karen and Ken walking past I like that she is leaning down going get out of the pool. I'm like ma'am. I don't know you I I'm never gonna listen to anything you say, so you might as well save your time. How much your ticket, man? Yeah, we're like, where's the ticket? Where's your ticket? <laughs> no, I'm not like, where is it? Like, what are you talking about? Like, yeah, no, let's stop. This is gonna have a picture this time, man. You gotta get, you gotta get off this seat, man. Come up, come up, come up that seat, please. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, you gotta get off this seat, man. What are you man. mean I don't have a ticket? Yeah, I am gonna give so, you my ticket. Show me your ticket, ticket then. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to do that right now. <laughs> Then do it, Karen. Yeah. Sure. What the heck? This guy's just like trying to be so reasonable, but he's like, also, what in the world is happening? Like, what? I like that she's just laughing too, to stall. <laughs> like, what the hell? What do you even do? Oh my gosh. Karens are crazy. Well, I'm about to show you my ticket then. I'm like, do it, lady. I'm waiting. I would prefer it if you did. Your dog is uh, pooping all over you. Yeah, I don't like that. Let's see if he's pooping. Yeah. How are you, Kiko boy? It's COVID, sir. It's COVID. You need to keep uh, distance from me. No, no, you need to keep distance from me. You're on my island. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, yeah, this is you guys are here. No. Yeah, yeah. This is, this no, is no, our place. Sorry, yeah. buddy. You guys are visiting us. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you guys are visiting us. Huh? What are you gonna do? Don't push it. What are you gonna do? Don't push it. What are you gonna do? Get out of here. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Get out of here. Get out of here. What in the world? Okay, first of all, I really want to know where they are. Second of all, you're telling me that all these people came up to this guy, who's just, you know, walking his dog, and then they say that they're like, well, you need to, you know, stay away from us, social distancing, blah, 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 the whole nine yards. If you actually cared about that, first of all, you would leave. You know, you would you would evacuate the area yourself. Um, and I feel like you came up to this man because at the beginning they were trying to like give him shit. So I don't know. It's just a whole group of Karens. What do you call a group of Karens? I don't know. Let me know. Chris, you got any ideas? What's a group of Karens called? A flock. A flock, a flock of Karens. <laughs> they definitely sound like seagulls when they're all just yelling. We Karens try to ruin the show, but you are the show. And why are you cursing? You know, whatever. How do you, the fan being fanned <laughs> to the beat of the music is so funny to me. I just love that. What does she even want? I don't even know what she's upset about. Let's just enjoy the show. Enjoy the music, focus up there, turn around. I'm just gonna be over here dancing. <laughs> no. <laughs> She was coming in hot too. I'm glad that those people were, I mean, that's obviously exactly why they're there. <laughs> but man, she was not looking. She was just free falling. <laughs> okay, I don't know if she was a Karen. I think she was just, you know, paying as much attention as maybe she should be. But who knows, maybe the video continues. It's sunny, look at sunny, it's beautiful. Where are we? You think the J-string's not good? No, not not a fan. Yeah. Yeah. It is great. That's all right. No, you 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 child to your opinion. Right. Was she talking about air? Was she talking about air? Because honestly, the the lady looked uh, <laughs> looking pretty good there. 
It's a spicy meatball. But uh, that's, I find that kind of weird though, man. Like, it, it's a beach. You kind of do whatever you want. I don't know. Like, it's, and it's Australia. Does Australia have, like, nudie beaches? Do they have that? They have, uh, they have beaches where you gotta wear less? I feel like they do. They're, like, basically European, right? Right? Come on. They gotta have, like, some, right, come on down. Just take your top off. No problem. It's also fine. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Is that what I People are like, he does Australia now. He does Australia now. Oh, guys. Oh, man. What's illegal? Oh, yeah. Give me a Look at this, look at this guy, go. This is my job. By my okay, this is my job. My job. Show me the license. I don't need a license. He wants a removal. My thing is right there. He wants a removal. You crazy psycho. Can you call any? Call any cop you want, sir. You can call Basically. anyone you so want. Yeah, those are mine, man. Those are mine. Yeah, it's cool. No, I'm not. You can't, you can't let them go. That's invasive species. Are you are you local in your head or what? They're invasive species. You cannot let them go. Are you not good in your head? I've been waiting for someone to come at me like that, bro. <laughs> Oh no, do not be waiting. Do not be waiting for that moment. Live your life peacefully. This guy does iguana removal? I'm in the wrong business. <laughs> I have so many questions, not about the video, about what this guy does for a living. Also, you don't need a state license, so I'm in the clear. <laughs> don't, 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 don't. Touch me, oh. you touch me. Not sure what happened, but it looks like some woman was getting kicked out of a place for doing something. Also, I don't know. Those sandals, that's a crime. You're clearly in the wrong. It's it's hard to tell with a clip like this because like you, you gotta see this stuff before, but I don't know. He was calm, he was asking her to leave. The only person I heard screaming in this video was said Karen. So what did you say? Yeah. Treat wait staff, especially if you're traveling, be nice to servers. Like anywhere. Tipping is different wherever you go. And like the culture is different. Just just be the most respectful person you can be all the time at, at restaurants. Olivia tells me horror stories every weekend. I'm like, hey, how's it work? She's like, eh, you know, just got verbally assaulted by this many people. I'm like, awesome. I'm putting on shoes at 2 a.m. I'm like, no, let's just go see if they're still there. I don't know. You are disturbing the people. So are you! So are you! So are they! Oh all boy. of them! I'm not Here doing no It doesn't what my recreational fucking uh, I'm gonna get No! You're gonna he's gonna get beat up is what he's gonna get. Wow, this was heated, man. This was heated. My dude wanted to throw hands. Not cool, we don't want to throw cans. It's a vacay right now. We're then come over here and coach me! Please stop! No! You came oh, down here to me! Alright, well let's leave it like that. And you come down here running your That's what the Mind your f***ing business. Try to figure out what vehicle he's actually in though. Like is he in a boat right now? Like is he in like a golf cart like they are? Like what was he doing donuts in? You know like is he on an ATV? Like what, what were you doing? Like a motorbike? I don't know. Comment down below. What was this guy riding that was causing the problems? What is going on? Horrible beach day, first of all. I mean, I get it. <laughs> hey, save the planet, I guess. I'm not sure what's going on there, to be honest with you. But like, I don't think, I don't know. I have no idea what's going on there. It looks like a terrible beach day. The sun's not out, he seems maybe upset. And he's throwing his own belongings into the ocean. Like Rose through the, when she does that, the little, she had no idea inflation rates would go up, eh? She regrets throwing that diamond into the ocean. She's like, huh? oh no. That's so stupid. Olivia has not seen Titanic. She has not seen the movie Titanic. Let's all give her shit for it next time we see her. <laughs> I assume, okay, it's like vacations in the video, so I assume that this is like somewhere they shouldn't be on vacation. Yeah, don't be jumping into rice fields anywhere, or anyone's field for that matter. Don't be doing belly flops. I mean, not only because you'll get, you know, in trouble, you'll mess up their crops and all that normal adult stuff and all those adult reasons why you shouldn't do this. Um, bugs, rocks, dangerous other things, I don't know. The primal problems right in front of you. Why wouldn't you want to jump into a field? Maybe there's a gross bug.
What? That was... <laughs> Everything about that was the most chaotic, but also at the same time, the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Like, that water is so gorgeous, that sand, but then it's just absolute chaos. The last thing I was expecting was to see a horse galloping away. That's so funny. Wow, what a fever dream. ¿Sabes qué? Me duele tanto ver la desigualdad y el racismo. O sea, te voy a explicar qué pasó y sí nos vamos a ir, porque entiendo tu trabajo. Eres un trabajador. Pero ¿sabes qué? Ella ha tenido música en inglés y no dice nada. Pero como nuestra música era en español, ella con una mala actitud desconectó y se llevaba nuestra bocina. Una de ellas se quejó por la música hispana. Classic. Classic. It's not Bieber, so now we're complaining. It's hard, there's not a lot of context in that video, but sounds like some Karens are complaining because their favorite top 40 isn't playing all the time. All those songs you want to hear in the radio 24 7 is not playing over here, so now we have an issue. She's like, is this, is this Maroon 5? No, this is not Maroon 5. Well, then let's talk to the manager then. Adam Levine or Bust? Go ahead, Karen. You're a white trash. Go ahead, Karen. Go ahead, Karen. Yeah. I wonder where she's from. Yeah, go make a fool of yourself. Go ahead. Make a fool of yourself. Continue. 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 No, I own a house here. I pay taxes here. Where's your house at? Where's your house? Nothing more intimidating than a girl yelling at you in bushes with like no shoes on. I don't know. Who's in the background too? Like someone who's like clearly like, yeah, I'm gonna support my best friend. She's got the white claws, so I gotta kinda be there. But like also non like not contributing at all. Just like working on her tan in the back with like the one leg sticking out. Just hmm. girl in the background's just alternating legs while she's tanning. Like, that's good. It doesn't matter. You can't be here. It's a private school here. It is a private Okay, what's your address? Wow. Man, it's just like, it's one of those situations where like, I, I, I don't even understand how you could possibly have that much energy to, to do that. No, 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 I don't care. You either tell me where you're Oh my gosh. Lady, like, who put you in charge here? <laughs> I guess I get it if hundreds of people were showing up out of the blue and like completely ruining your pool and they didn't live there and like yeah like that's when it becomes a problem. But if you have an issue like that, I guess you just take it up with the management. Don't do this and like be YouTube star. Like welcome to YouTube lady, like here you are now. Come down here. I'm not coming down here. Don't be silly. Come down here. One. Oh she's counting. She must be a mom. One, two, oh, I'm another drink nicely. first. Leave me alone, that's all. But do you think I'm trying to leave I don't, I'm not saying you're trying to I'm do not. anything, but just leave me alone. I'm just asking you to leave me alone. Hey. There's a giant pool, and you're coming up to my chair and bothering me right now. So, like, what's your name? I don't want to talk to you. That's all I, ha I had enough, He's okay? Leave me alone. Twice now I said leave me alone. You're, you're very incapacitated right now, and you're bothering me. No, you're bothering me. And you should leave my area. I asked you so no. many times. Even your this friend is, wild. is hey. trying to get you out of here. So hey. why the pool is comedic large. Okay. Wild. Yeah, the way she started counting, I, that man has so much patience. Especially on vacation too. He's like, oh, this is the one week I get just to like literally sit here and not think about people like this yelling at me at work. Oh my God. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on here, but you can just tell by the way she's like one, two, and then has another sip of her like double rum and coke. That's something, something foul as a foot here, it seems. Yeah, I don't know. She's probably one of those moms that just counts for everything, you know what I mean? My mom would count on a lot of stuff like that. My mom was like low-key a Karen, you know? No one's gonna say anything, but I'm like, yeah, I think I think my mom was a Karen. God rest her soul. I think she was uh, I think she was one of the Karens. Wait, so maybe I am drunk. Am I wrong? Yes, we just had well, to sell what, Karen. Why would they keep okay? me the, they they removed me from the casino if I'm too drunk? Oh. <laughs> the man went into the fifth dimension. <laughs> The shirt really adds to whatever is going on here, to be quite honest. <laughs> like, that's quite the shirt. Also, he got kicked out of a casino. Gambling is bad. It all, you know, intertwines with each other. <laughs> it's all related. I knew you were trouble as soon as I saw you. I'd ask that you please, this guy. I would ask that you please stay six feet from me. Stay away. 
I'm just Ray Payton, mother. This guy like pulled the Uno reverse card on death. <laughs> I don't... Stay away from him. Stay away from him. This is a race baby. This is a race. Baiter. At this point, you just stay away, okay? Or I'm gonna call the police. I will call the police. Go ahead. I like this, this guy, well, I don't like this. There's clearly an issue here, but this guy's just hammered on the beach, vibing a little too hard. <laughs> you're, you're publicly intoxicated, that's clear. Public intoxication is a crime. It's a felony, so. Stay away from him. Stay away from him. What were they even doing? Why was this guy also, death in flip-flops is hilarious. <laughs> I love that, but why was why were they on the beach? What were they doing? What were they there for? I got a lot of questions. Did he die? Sure uh oh. Who's paying for this? Oh my! Hey, hon, the girl ever to crash her car and get an Uber and say F this car? Yeah, we love you, girl. She's like F this car. I'm out. She got the escape car and this. <laughs> That Not girl fled the scene. No, she fled the scene. Picture her. That, yeah, of course. Yes. Yeah, it's I, the I car that's in the yeah, pool. Yeah, yeah. It's that one. That's her. That's definitely her, officer. Yeah, I have video of her in the driver's seat of that. Yeah, wow. You guys really did get her. Wow. Oh wow. Okay, so so she just crashed, and then got her luggage, and then just got another car. That was so confusing. Who is this girl? Where is she? What future is she from? This is like Grand Theft Auto in real life. That's crazy. Well, hopefully no one got hurt there, but I don't even know what I'm watching. Hope, hope, hope everyone's okay. <laughs> Karens. I don't think that's a Karen. I think that's just like someone avoiding the scene of crime. I guess that is a Karen, really. What is a Karen? <laughs> That's so scary. That was the scariest thing I've ever seen. That was like a real life horror movie. Ooh, I did not like that. Ew, what a creep. <laughs> classic. This is a classic video. Tonight's dinner. Commitment. Word. What year is this from? <laughs> Man, this is a classic video. And it's just like the most this is what teenagers used to do. I saw this as a kid. Oh, he's calling his friends over there. Like, it's good, the castle. Oh, it's fun. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. He just went to be show over there. This is excellent, dude. Excellent, man. Excellent, excellent. Yeah. Stuff like this when I was a kid. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, the poor seagulls, though. I'm not for doing this, but it the video is good. We did it one time and we can just leave it alone. You know what I'm saying? Just leave that in the past. Oh, so we did. What? What? Idiot. What the heck? Imagine like getting a tan and then you got to dodge a horse. Elder Greek Karen's freak out when dogs try to swim in the sea. Why are you freaking out, Elder Greek Karen? Why are you freaking out? Just like let it lie, like let it be, dude. Like look where you are, and you're causing problems with the dog. Just chill, man. Like relax. Oh, but it's a doggy. <laughs> Oh my god, chill lady, chill. All right, uh, story time. Guys, I've been to Greece before. It is so, so beautiful. I don't even know how you could, in an environment like this, have any sort of like stresses or anything in your life. Working third shift at a hotel dealing with it's like for part to wait for it. I got three complaints that you're knocking on doors. Do you have a room? Yeah. What's your room? 204. 204, so why are you on the third floor? I got locked up here, these doors are locked, man. What are you talking about? You can walk right out the store. Oh man, this is just like a terrible situation to be in. The doors have locks on them. All right, come on, you gotta get off the third floor. Who said I knocked on the door? What? Three three different calls. What, what were the rooms? I'm not gonna tell you that. Get off the third floor, please, before I kick you out. Did I knock on the door? Hey, get the f out right now, go. I didn't knock get on out. the door. Get out, get the f out of here, go. I'm sorry, man, I'm no, sorry. Get 
Oh my god. Just like the absolute worst response you could possibly have. Working at a hotel, like, there's probably some crazy stories. Hey you, if you work at a hotel, let us know what it's like. Is it fun? Is it stressful? Is it weird? Give us a little insight. I wanna work at a hotel. We have somebody monetization, please. Uh, yeah, um, that's wild. I mean, man, like, it's gonna cost you a lot more money now. <laughs> Young guy in here putting the machines about, we smashing them up. Um, we need assistance surgery. <laughs> this is bad. Oh. No, it's Bet Fred's in Cowley. That's where. Bet Fred's Temple Square, Cowley. Um, yeah, uh, one second. This is crazy. He was mad. That move at the end. He meant business. Don't gamble. Don't gamble. It's just bad. I know it's fun, but it's bad. It's bad and it's addictive and it's scary and risky. I'm not a gambler. I'm not a risk taker. I like to play it safe. Where have you come from? Where have you all come from? You've come over on a ship, a boat, have you over the channel? How come you're staying here in Barrow in Furnace? Who's putting you up and who's paying for your, your rent? Who's paying for your rent? Yeah, God, you're harassing like nine people? How come you've come to Barrow in Furnace? I know it's not a hotel, it's a hotel for migrants. We've got homeless people in our town and these are coming here living uh, here for nothing. Like a a very uh, racial what, rant here. I don't know if y'all can play this, but... I've seen it all over, all over the town. And I'm gonna get the lotters. I'm gonna get the lotters out of this town. Believe me. It's not even like a Karen. That's just like the devil. The devil, but he's <laughs> Scottish. So Scottish. At, at the end, they're like, Sir, we really don't know what you're complaining about because we can't understand you. You sound like you have <laughs> a barge in your mouth. I don't know. Now I'm making fun of Scottish people. Now I'm the villain. I don't want to be the villain here. I'm Scottish. <laughs> My family's like, how could you? I'm like, listen, that one video of the one guy really makes me not want to be Scottish. Oh my god, they have guns. Jesus, Jesus. Go, 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 no, 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 please, 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 what? Please, please, please. Please, what? <laughs> Dang, that's crazy. They were so scared. You could tell that was like genuine, like real fear. Please, please, yeah, please. Yeah, no, 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 okay, okay. Hey, no. No, 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 it's okay, he's got his hand on his shoulder. They shook hands, he's like, no, no problem. He's like, okay, we're just making sure everything's good, all right? What's your name? Philip. Huh? No problem. May I speak English a little? A little. Don't be scared, help is on the way. <laughs> help is arrived, I don't fucking know. Because why? Because of why? Because, because why? Why? What did we do? That's pretty cool, doglish. Just saying. <laughs> Who says? Who said that? Because we've been coming here for years and we always do that. Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, you are right. That is why she's doing it. She does not have a life. We've never, there's so many people that do that. Why are you giving me a look? We've been coming here for years. Mm. 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 And we've never had a problem. We've never had a problem. But you want to come and make a problem when we're just kidding? Yeah, yeah. Because you have no life, right? I just want to say though, that leash is cool. It's got like lights on it and stuff. You know, it's like you can see your dog and it's like it's there and like, but it's also like looks cool. That's my biggest takeaway from this video is like, honestly, like you're a Karen and like you suck, but like you have a really cool leash. I just asked this lady to stop harassing these people. Wow, this looks they like an awesome area. Home. Wow, yeah, I mean, I think they were both popping off right there. Like, they were both elite levels. We all believe you. Too, not okay. just you. I know everyone Then mind your own business. This is my business. I don't know who started it. I think it was the lady in the blue there, but, like, just, like, mind your business, seriously. What? You wear your you shoes today is your business. I do. I don't have to show you yes, that. Yes, you do if I ask you. No, I don't. You don't Karen's want to 
Also, another big takeaway from that one, did you guys see that cool slide in the background? Like that entire area just looked freaking awesome. I I'm getting like serious cottage vibes right now. Like I gotta go to a potty soon. Got dogs out. <laughs> That's so funny. Aw, why do they always, like, it's always the dogs that are working that look so cute when you can't pet them, but you want to, but they're working. Love little dogs, little working dogs. It's so cute. This is hilarious. I mean, I bet some of those people were running just because other people were running and they just felt like they were supposed to do that. But uh, not all of them. That's definitely for sure. Why did you just kill that fish and throw it back in and kill it? I didn't kill it. You did so. I saw it and it's I floating here. Fish, though, I tried to release it, but it didn't release, so I did not kill it. You did. I saw it here and it's just flapping up and around. Well, what, what did happen? Why was the fish floating? What do you mean it ended up floating? Like, did it end up dying? You've got to hide. Can I see your fishing license, please? I do have a fishing license. Yeah, good. I'll put you on YouTube as well. That's okay. That's all right. I'm, uh, there's nothing wrong that I've done. Absolutely nothing wrong. Are you allowed to kill it? Did it actually kill it? Did you like? Are you, you should probably not be throwing it back in the. I don't know, man. I don't know anything about fishing, so like, I feel like I'm not the best one to comment on this video. What happened to the fish, man? Like, why why was it floating if it's not dead? Then you know, pretty weird fish, huh? <laughs> I'm just asking. So it's, it's gonna be your. I turn, got so some I got some pink over here. Oh, I, I've seen this one before. Here we go. Here comes the scream, everybody. Yeah, get out of here. Like, literally get out of here, man. Like, there it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Wow. I don't even know, like, who are you? Like, who gave you your adult license? Who promoted you from teenager or kid or freaking toddler to adult? You know, like, whoever did that needs to be fired because, like, you got to get demoted. Like, we got to send you straight back to toddler camp, kindergarten class, like, put you in the corner for a little bit. You need to go on timeout. Yo, yo, yo. 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 I mean, yo. Okay. We'll talk after. Yo, 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 I have yo. thoughts about this one. Yo. First of all, you're so annoying. Okay, it's done, here we go. Ooh, okay, quick little rant coming out. So I'm hoping slash assuming that that's the bike lane. I'm like, huh, it's on the right side, not the left. Interesting, yeah, other places have opposites. We know this. Okay, cool, you're doing a wheelie, so it's like, are you the jerk? I don't know, maybe, no, that's a bike lane. I'm hoping that's a bike lane. That's a bike lane and you're doing wheelies, that's cool. Just, there's so many pe people walking, there's kids. Maybe just don't do the cool wheelie for like a hot second. Maybe do wheelies after the bridge, crowded with people and children, maybe. I don't know, just an idea. And also don't go, hey, yo, hey, yo, yo, the whole time, because that's really annoying. They have bells for that reason. Just do that. Or customize a bell. Yo. 15, we have to stand by the whole damn day. Our flight was supposed to leave in 10 minutes and we missed our oh. flight and they got nothing available. All day, you know? I'm gonna miss a whole day at work for this. Mm -hmm. Got here late and didn't expect the line to be like this. Then it was a problem with the credit card, I guess, or something. Why yeah, did they you expect you to be here two hours airport. before departure. You showed up 20 minutes before departure. Yeah, I mean, like, that's literally your own fault. Like, if you're not aware, of airports and like how freaking long they take three hours guys like that's what it is like you get there three hours beforehand because the line the line takes about 40 minutes 40 to 50 minutes well we've never been here before so i didn't know this okay okay well that's your own fault that's ridiculous. and yeah if you get there three hours beforehand are you gonna have to sit and wait for probably an hour or so like after you get through yes you are but i'd rather sit and wait for my my flight and actually make my flight then show up 20 minutes before and not make it and then cause this scene and not get where I'm going, you know? Like, three hours, guys. Them's the rules. I said you, can't, I said you can't have guests here without your parents being here. Okay? Why? 
because that's the rule. So why are you here? Why are you here in street clothes? Man, what are the rules? That's I think that is what this one boils down to. Like, I also don't know. Oh, okay, actually, you know what? It doesn't even boil down to that. Like, who cares? <laughs> you know, like it's in the rules form that they signed. You didn't sign that, so you don't aware wear the rules. They Who's have to parents? be here. Go get your parents to come down here. My parents are at the lake because I'm a responsible adult and no need them to babysit me. You're not me. being responsible yeah, right no, now. I just read the rules. I just read them like three days ago. I love how you men love to tell me what to do, but I'm a woman and I'm not gonna let you harass me. I think that's what it boils down to. Like, who actually cares? Maybe that is in the rule book. Oh, I didn't study this thing up, dude. Like, I don't care. Like, just leave me alone. Go away and leave me alone. That's not the way the protocol is here at the beach. You can't just stand there. People are waiting in line. We've all been waiting in line. We've been waiting in line. I've just seen the fucking Well, they need to circle around like we have. Oh my gosh. Why does everyone think that they can just stand in a spot to hold a parking spot? Especially, like she said, when there's a line to get a parking spot? Absolutely not. No, ma'am. You need to move. You need to move. You need to move. Get the lifeguard, I will. <laughs> it's just not happening. And then the fact that she leaves when she goes to get the lifeguard, because she knows she's wrong. That's the thing. She thought that they were just gonna like, you know, whatever, be like, it's not worth it. But sometimes you gotta stick to your guns. Everyone was a Karen here, but that doesn't mean that some people were in the wrong. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you have to be a Karen. Wow, my guys are quick. This is unbelievable. Oh, she's causing big problems, eh? No, oh my God. don't. Oh my God. Don't. Bro, literally, that right there is when I trip on her. Eat it, fake an injury, and be like, oh my God, like Karen, like you did this to me. And like, we got it all on video. You know, it's like literally that is, that's what I do there. Cause what is she gonna say? Oh, like they, like I was lying there. No, you weren't. You just went in there. Like, boom, we got her. That is, I, I know it's petty folks, but like sometimes you gotta pull the stops out. <laughs> Okay, so then why, why do you dress this way? Dude, what? I'm a hat and I like women, so please leave us alone. Well, Kindly. Well, take, take young I'm at the beach in take, my bathing take, suit. Yeah, that's, that's a thong and that's a bra. Dude, just like walk away. Like, just... That is a bathing suit, Take young sir. guys into consideration. They don't need to see pornography right now. Oh my god. Why you please go away? You're flaunting your stuff. I'm not flaunting anything. Don't look at me. <laughs> You look around and, and you're the only thing that sticks out because your whole body okay, is Okay, well showing. why are you looking at me? If it is actually causing you that much of a problem, just don't look in that direction. Like seriously, it's like why are you concerning yourself with these other people, you know? It's just, I, I, I don't know. Maybe you're the problem. To me. She punched me. Don't feel little girl. I love her Why are you punching me? My son punches you. Why are you punching me? If my son punches you, you'll know. I love her accent. No, I will take video. I don't take. So you see the one tooth, guys? She was sporting like a solid one tooth right there, guys. Like, I think that there was literally like one guy in there. I'm surprised that she's even capable of like getting out those words. If my son's been here, yeah. Well, I'm not, I'm yeah. I can actually hear what you're saying. My son's are blacker than you, so f you racism. Oh my goodness. Take good care of your teeth. That look is not at all flattering on you. My goodness gracious, Karen. Like, this is just, a, this is a lot going on. I want to see what happened before this clip. I'm not sure if she did actually hit him or, like, if her son, because how did her son get factored into this? I don't know, man. Just Karen's being Karen's. Karen's that ruined their own vacation? Part eight. Holy smokes. Oh, Oh, all right, let's see these Karens, 10, 10, 15 in the morning. Holy jays. Well, a lot of hotel stuff today, okay. This looks like it's another hotel, too. We got a lot of hotels today. Is, is the title hotels? Uh, vacation. 
Oh, vacation. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. You go on vacation, you walk in, you book a hotel. That makes sense. Okay, that makes sense now. Yeah, yeah, okay. I can use a vacation. Everyone, everyone can use a vacation. Go take a vacation. Oh, God, I got a hair. I got a hair in my. Oh, damn, I got a hair in my. That's the best way I can say that girl at night without saying it. Um.